Amir Khan. He's Bolton's finest. Watch for those hands tonight. They are as fast as they come. King Rai, Ryan Garcia, one of the brightest stars in all of boxing. This Southern California native is must-see TV. You can hardly hear yourself speak. The fans are going mad for this. The crowd is ready. I'm ready. And here we go. This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. In the red corner... From Bolton, England, here is the Olympic silver medalist, one of Britain's youngest ever professional world champion, a unified 140-pound champion of the world, introducing Amir King Khan. Hiding out of the blue corner from Victorville, California, here is the exciting boxing sensation, introducing King Rai Ryan. Garcia! You can tell both of these fighters are exuding confidence as they touch gloves. And here we go. This is the fight of pride. This is two warriors that want to get in there and beat the hell out of each other. This is that fight. Good luck. These athletes have promised us a war. Let's see if they deliver. Scoring left hand. Both of these men showing exceptional chins, by the way. And counter punching. Not too many seats to be had in this arena as the hype continues to build for this showdown. This is not just hype. We are in for something special tonight. What an arena, what an atmosphere, what a build-up. Punch scores. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. To life now, starting to land some punches. This counter puncher is going to wait for you to move first and then will strike like a snake. Keep an eye on this guy. If you're fighting a counter puncher, you've got a dummy shot. Make them react from that, then react then. I know it's hard to think that way, but counter punchers, they're watching you, watching you every move, that every trick. He just misses with that jab. This round could go either way. Ten seconds to go. Pretty dominant round there. Let's see how they respond here in the next round. And there's the bell for round two. Defending themselves. That punch landed. The counter fighter relies a lot on their instincts and reaction time. You've got to get in there quick to punch your opponent before he gets his fist back to block. To be a counter puncher, you've got to take them out of their pace. Do not wait for them, because if you wait, they'll pepper and pop you all night long. Rush them. Just gets out of the way of that right uppercut. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. You can tell he's stronger, but he's not faster. This is one of those 
fights where if you blink, you probably miss about three or four punches. That's the kind of output we're going to see. Remember, with a lighter weight, you're expecting at least 300 shots around. They can let these shots go. They can move their fast, their sharp. That's a hard night work for the referee. And this with that jab. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. There's the bell for round three. Nice exchange here from both men. When you're a power puncher, you're not as concerned with how many punches you throw. It's about how many you land and how hard they are. Sometimes when you get nervous, someone that's so powerful, you can't think of You just gotta be smarter than them. You gotta be like a little fagin and pickpocket them. There's no doubt that this fighter's power can change the fight around in an instant. You can't afford to make one single minor mistake. And he misses with the left uppercut. These two are the perfect dance partner. One of these fighters is starting to run out of gas. What do you do as a fighter when you just don't have the energy? Now you've got two fighters that are absolutely shattered. What gets you through? Willpower. Calm, because if you panic, you get desperate. If you get desperate, you make mistakes. If you make mistakes, you get knocked out. Fight has a real good flow to it. Fantastic punch. Very close round with 10 seconds to go. We about to see Ryan Garcia go to the canvas. It's no secret. Back at it in round four. There's no doubt that this fighter's power can change the fight around in an instant. You can't afford to make one single minor mistake. This could be really intimidating, Todd. If you know somebody's got the punch power, someone's got the speed, someone can take you out with a simple jab, it can be intimidating. Just depends on how confident you are as a fighter. Good punch. They're both trying for a knockout. Heard the phrase finding a second win. I don't think I need to tell you which one of these fighters needs to find it. What can they change? They can change their attitude, they can change their, their nervous system for a certain amount of punches per round. Because otherwise, if they deviate from the game plan, they're going to be shattered once again and the fight will be over. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. to see Ryan Garcia go to the camp. here and I think he knows who's won this one. Right now the flash is seeing flashes after that shot. And the kid goes down. One, two, three, four, five, six. Beaten. 
fires the bell for round five. He just misses with that big right hand. You couldn't write a script like this. This is like Rocky versus Apollo. We hear that old phrase, second win. You've got to find it somehow. Midway through the fight, if you are tired, this can be the loneliest place in the world. If you cheated, now we're going to find out. Left hand misses. <laughs> nice exchanges from both men in this round. That left scores. In the early rounds of a fight, you'll see two boxers feel each other out, test each other's power, and I think this boxer has decided I can walk through anything that lands. You know what? Sometimes when a bell in the ring, you fight like that, and you punch them, you just want to win. You want that spaceship to come and lift you out of there because you think, what the hell am I going to do now? punch! Despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. He threw the hook, didn't land. This is some of the best action I've seen in any round, anywhere this year. Energy and endurance are not an issue for this fighter who continues to be aggressive as the rounds wear on. I've seen some aggressive fighters like this, and they are a nightmare. If you are not fit, if you are not fit, that is the worst place to be, having second thoughts in the ring. Why aren't they defending? Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. There's a right hand. When we talk about a fighter having power, don't just look at the head punches they throw. Look at the body shots. That could be the real difference. You've got to be courageous when you get in there with someone that's bigger, stronger, and faster. You've just got to use brain man. Good one. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. Here we go, it's round seven. Coming back to life now, starting to land some punches. Caution being thrown to the wind. a power puncher you're not as concerned with how many punches you throw it's about how many you land and how hard they are hard we know one of these fights can knock you out with a simple jab they're that powerful oh. 
Missed him with that uppercut. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. Neither man really defending themselves. One of these fighters want to see the judges' scorecards. I think it's safe to say one of these fighters certainly has a significant speed advantage. You can tell who it is. When you've got a fast fighter, they will cut you to ribbons, and they know it's a matter of time before either you get desperate or the referee jumps in and saves you. This is a natural gift. This round could go either way. Ten seconds to go. You heard the old friend. And there's the bell for round eight. here at all. Begin the count. Ten seconds to get up. I don't see any movement here. It looks like this one's going to be over. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, and it's flashing lights for the flash here. He's got to get out of trouble. Couldn't take anymore. And down goes Garcia. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, you're out. You heard that right, ladies and gentlemen. A knockout victory and one of the biggest surprises of the year. Accuracy, power. Punch perfect. That must hurt. 